Hey, this is the coach with mwellerymedia.com and computerstacoma.com and today we're going to be going over a quick tutorial on how to do you hear my chair Jeez, louise uh we're gonna we're gonna go over a video on how to uh correct some of the color that's in your video uh and we're gonna use this this one right here as a uh, an example so the first thing you want to do is go over here to the timeline over here and click on track effects Okay, then what you want to do is you want to come down here to Sony Color Corrector Secondary. Click on OK. All right. Okay, now you can see that the video that I shot here isn't really so much the camera as it is just, it was just kind of a uh, overcast day and just didn't quite pick up the colors as well as, I, as I'd like to, as well as I'd like to have. Uh, done, uh, but um, we're going to go ahead and try and correct some of that. So how we do that is we go ahead and take this uh, saturation bar right here and boost that up a little bit. Okay, see the colors come out a little bit more, and that's pretty extreme. That's pretty extreme, but we want to bring it to about right here possibly. Okay, and you see the difference between it off and on off and on and then let's find another part of the video here let's swift it uh, here's one right here you can tell um, off on okay let's let's increase that a little bit more ooh look at that fine blue right there Isn't that nice go ahead and hit play see what else do we have here um here's something here in emerald downs here in seattle look at the colors on that let's go ahead and pause that Oop, hang on stand by stand by and go ahead and turn it off turn it on so you see the difference here it really can bring out some real beautiful colors um i'll show you one other thing too oh hey i almost forgot one thing it's getting kind of late here at night and I'm uh, getting kind of tired, but check this out here. See where it says preset? Click on this right here and go from computer RGB to studio RGB. Okay. Now let's increase the saturation a little bit. Ooh, look at those colors. Pretty nice. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. Let's go ahead and hit play. Okay. Look at the blues there. Let's adjust that a little bit more. Pretty nice. Pretty nice. Pretty nice. Here's the new Joint Strike Fighter. Look at that. That's a little that's a little much. We can tone that down a little bit. But here's the other thing. Okay, so here's what we want to do. Uh, we want to go back uh, to the track effects, and we're going to click on. Let's get this over here a little bit. We're running. We are running out of room. Okay. Uh, we want to go to. Track effects, okay. And we're going to go to Sony levels. Click OK. All right. And let's get this back down here so we can see what we're doing. All right. Now, part of the thing is, is that if you're going to use both of these at the same time, you're going to have to make some uh, uh, you're going to have to make some adjustments here because it's going to having both these going at the same time really going to bring out a lot of the blacks, okay? And so you're going to have to push up your gain a little bit, a little bit more maybe, uh, so it won't be so dark. But using both these at the same time will give you a a rich uh, film effect, uh, which is really nice. So I hope these tutorials. Uh, uh, can help you. And uh, again, I'm Mark Woolery with uh, mwoolerymedia.com and computerstacoma.com. And you can find more tips like this at uh, computerstacoma.com and mwoolerymedia.com. And be sure to stop by uh, our site and see if we can give you uh, some more help. All right. Well, listen, have a great day.